Hello, everybody. Right, I've got D. Riley, magician extraordinaire, and he's assured me he's going to do a teddy bear trick today. So um, we're going to record this live. Well, live now. We're doing it live. But it won't be live when you're seeing this. I'm going to send it over to just to confuse you. <laughs> right. Well, good afternoon. Where are you from, by the way? London. It's London. London. Yeah, 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 London. yeah, yeah. That's where I'm based. Right, so what's this teddy bear trick we're going to do? So I'm thinking we're going to go abstract with this. Instead of literally getting a bear and putting it down, you have a favourite bear in mind, yeah? Well, I've got to think of a favourite bear yeah. in here. Yeah, but we don't say out loud. Have I got to be able to see it? Or could... No, it could be anything. It could be, could be anywhere. Not that you necessarily can see it. If you can't see it, maybe even better, because then I can't necessarily see it. I can't okay, see well, I've looking. got a favourite bear. You have, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. good. Yeah, yeah. So I've got something for you here, inside here. Small piece of card, my little business card wallet. I want to give you that there. And on there, I want you to do two things without me seeing and also without the camera seeing. So I want you to write the word you're thinking of, so the name of the bear, not nice and clear, so that if you, when you show it to the camera, they'll know what you're thinking of. So write the name of the bear nice and clear. And also try and draw a rough drawing of the bear, because they all have different styles, right? right. Uh, this bear doesn't necessarily, does it have to be here? No. No. Oh, okay. No, it doesn't have to be here at all. So don't let me see. So right, what have we got right? So nice and clear. I want you to write the name of the bear nice and clear. And I also want you to try and draw the bear roughly in terms of how it kind of looks. If it's fluffy, it's smooth. If the ears are big, small. Just a rough kind of drawing. Um, and then you're going to show the camera that. So that's why you make it nice and clear. But obviously don't show me. There's a lot of bears in here. So, I mean, obviously, if anyone's familiar with this, there's there's hundreds of bears that you can think of here. There's not just one or two. Can I put a word on here to, to help the description of my bear? Okay, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That's fine. Then the, then the viewers can see that. I'll look away. Obviously, you've got loads of bears in here. So, this is a, it's a real mix. I think people that know me will probably yeah. know what I'm talking okay, about. I'll look away. If you I'm going to put it up show the camera so that they can see. I think everyone knows that bear. Yeah. Yeah. Right, yeah, okay, done. I'll take the pen back first. Right, pen back. Sure. Put that there just on the clipboard. And uh, so that goes there. And the second one will take your drawing back because we don't actually need that until uh, until the end. Now, obviously, you've done this drawing of the bear, but you said that the audience might be familiar with the kind of bear that you've drawn here, yeah? So do you think that they, had they not seen what you've drawn here, do you think that they could guess it or not really? Do you reckon they could guess this bear here? If they, if Somebody they... might guess the name of the bear if they know me and associate a bear. Oh, okay, yeah. right, right, right. Okay, so so this is something a little bit different, right? So this is maybe something that's something to do with you, but some people might know it, depending if they know you or not. Okay, yeah. So my job, I've got to try and <laughs> guess what kind of bear you might think of. Um, now I'm aware that you've sort of looked around, so that's for ideas, right? But then you did say one key thing, which is the bear's not necessarily here, so it might not be one of the ones that I can just see uh so we'll try this okay so i want you to imagine what this kind of bear looks like and again you're gonna have to forgive my kind of drawing it's it's, it's going to be a little bit uh rough and ready but i'll try this okay and imagine the kind of colorings of the kind of bear yeah so like, okay something like that there okay so like that there maybe okay um okay good and you wrote did you write the name of this bear yes because yeah, you said you wrote something you wrote the name of this bear okay I'm just going to sort of sketch out a bear like that. That's what I kind of feel I'm seeing here. Uh, and imagine the, 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 the name of the bear now. Obviously, don't say it out loud. And what I want you to do is focus just on that first letter. Uh, that's it for me. Just imagine that first letter. It's like you're trying to tell me, but you don't want to say it out loud. Uh, keep going with it in your head. That first letter, it's just coming through just now. That's almost it. That's it there. Is that the letter S you're thinking of? Could be. S. S. So so maybe something like that there. An S. Uh, okay. Um, good. Uh, Is there any particular reason why this bear would be special to you? Uh, yes. If you were to say, would it give it away? Uh, well, not really. I mean, not wouldn't give the name okay. away or yeah, the bear yeah. away. Why, why is it special to you, this bear? It's the bear that I got that started this shop. That started this shop. So maybe something along the lines of that there then. Okay, I won't change my mind. I have done a drawing here. There's a drawing right here. And there's a word. I've written one word here, which is a, hopefully I think the name of the bear think uh but for the first time this afternoon this has been here the whole time this is your drawing okay yeah i want you to go inside there make sure that genuinely is your handwriting that hasn't been sort of switched up with anything nope still the same yep, still same. People. yep you can show them and for the first time this afternoon sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't i've never done it with bears before but i'm hoping it's close say it out loud what was the name of the bear and what did the bear look like let's have a little look stinky let's have a look oh you got a little bear like that <laughs> 
Do you know what I've got? Go Stinky. Well, oh, no, don't you do that. How did you do that? Because <laughs> Stinky is the first. I told you a story about me putting my foot in a stuffing machine yeah. at the NEC. Well, that was the bear. That was the bear. That, that I made after I wow. covered all that paper in fluff. Well, and then what happened was, was I started, um, you make a wish to yeah. get inside the telly, which I did. Yeah. And uh, amazing. 14 years later, here we are. Still we're here. here. And, but, but to reiterate, you didn't actually tell me at any point no, that bear's name. You you in that story. No, 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 I didn't even tell you about the bear. Stinky the bear, guys. Absolutely amazing. Well, I'll be honest with you. I'll give Dean Riley, <laughs> amazed, you've amazed me. This was BGT. You're getting the golden buzzer right there. <laughs> there we go. So you can have the bear buzzer. Have the bear buzzer. Oh, right. well done. Thank you. Oh, thank you. And I'll tell you, we'll put thank that out on the, uh, I think next Friday we're going to be, be doing this. So uh, you'll be seeing this next Friday on our show. Enjoy. Uh, if you want to see some magic, to, well, I can't uh, advertise it today because this is not going anywhere. What a shame. <laughs> well, you can find me online. Just Apparently D. Riley on Instagram. I'm there. Oh, there you go. D. Riley. And I'll put a link up when we do the thing. I'll put yeah. a link up on there to his, his Facebook page. You take care, guys. Right. Bye-bye now. Thank you.